And to Carlos. And he's going to be disappointed with that pass. Nice. That should be a goal there. There we go. Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here and welcome to another video. Ladies and gentlemen, we have Marcus Cunha to review today. This is one of the one of the cards that people have been interested in the most, to be honest, because of his very good stats. Uh, my boy over here bought him for 265k for a pretty decent card, to be honest. We're looking at someone that is six foot height with medium, medium work rates, four star, four star. So you guys already know he's starting real hot for me, right? Uh, in regards to attributes, we're looking at a card that has 90 acceleration, 87 sprint speed. So you may want to increase uh, the acceleration sprint speed. Potentially, we're going to see what's up with the rest of the card, right? Um, 90 finishing with 92 shot power, 89 long shots with 81 composure. So when I see that 81 composure, I instantly think I got to give him a sniper chemistry style, right? I want to give him the sniper chemistry style because the reactions being 80 and the composure being 81 need to fix those two things as well, right? Now... This is an interesting card, right? Because his passing, passing is 80 uh, short passing, 71 long passing. He has physical presence in game because I know that his stock is decent because of the fact that he's six foot and I've seen his card uh, before in game and his stock, he, like I said, he does have a decent stock. 87 stamina is quite decent, so I can do that tactic of comeback in the fence with him as well. 92 jumping, so if I keep him up top to win the ball in the air to head it off to other people, he'll do a good job of that as well. Aggression is okay there as well, considering the fact that he's 90 acceleration with 80 seven sprint speed as well as the physical stock um the big thing that we're gonna be testing out on this card again is going to be seeing whether it's worth giving him the sniper chemistry style or the engine chemistry style i kind of feel like potentially the 81 composure i might sacrifice the plus five for it with the engine chemistry style because when you take a look at this card right you're looking at someone that is six foot tall with 97 agility and 88 balance, okay? So, because that is the case, with the reactions being a, uh, 85, and then you're increasing the ball control and dribbling as much as possible, we have to see how responsive he is in game in regards to dribbling. I do think that those two chemistry styles are the best ones to give the card because I think that giving your players a dribbling boost is important for responsive gameplay in game. But I also think that it's very important uh, to be able to score most of your opportunities and to accelerate into the play when you need to, right? 90 acceleration, 87 sprint speed. This guy's already giving me like you know, like uh, a Holland vibe, you know what I'm saying? But but probably a better version of Holland, in all fairness, he could be. He could potentially be a way better version of Holland because that four-star, four-star. And he's like 265K, Brazilian links, you know, four-star, four-star, looking really nice. That we're going to be lined up in game is going to be like this. Four, two, three, one is going to be our, our typical instructions and tactics. He'll be lined up as a striker for me on balanced instructions, but because... It's a player V, we won't put comeback in the fence, but generally speaking, you could put comeback in the fence on the card, and um, he would do a decent job of it. So, uh, yeah, we're going to try him up top as a striker. Hopefully, his off the ball and on the ball movement is good because obviously both are very, very important in regards to him being a good striker. And Holland's obviously very, very expensive right now as a player of the month card. So, it's going to be interesting to see how, uh, how good this card is. Well, this team should be interesting to try out against. <laughs> and here's Cunha. Nice little layoff by Cunha over there. I like his positioning so far. It's really nice. Like I said, guys, the medium, medium work rated players, for some reason, they just do it for me, man. And here's Cunha. Good hold up play with Cunha right there. Get the ball back. Nice. Dribbling very responsive. Nice. Good dribbling, opens up the space beautifully for us, and we don't hit an empty net. Oh my god. He's, blo he's blocking the left side and I can't hit the other side. He, uh, ooh, ooh. I am liking Philippe, uh, I'm liking, I'm liking Cunha's card though so far guys, he's really, really nice. But I cannot believe I can't score that EA. I'm really liking this card. I, I actually really like him. He plays very nicely in game. Great positioning off the ball to lay off to the other players. I love the medium medium so much, dude. Get that angle. There it is. Little fakey fakes. Ball roll. Wait for it. There it is. Oh, just out. Just out. I had it there. It would have been a nice goal too, man. Gnabry. 
Good off the ball movement. Perfect. Wait for that pass. Oh, not a great pass there. If that was a better pass, see those ones are like the ones where it's like you're under a certain you're you're under certain pressure. Is your passing stats good enough? Like that's where it really matters in that general position. Um, because if he does have good passing and we wait for that transitioning run from the player that is facing forwards coming backwards, uh, we can get that goal scoring opportunity right there. Nice. That should be a goal there. There we go. He messed up right there. He messed up right there. We took advantage of it. Marcus Cu Mateo Mateos. Mateos Cunha. That's his name. Mateos Cunha. Nice little goal right there. I'm really liking the car, guys. Like, obviously, my boy over here is in, like, the higher division. So, people are going to have, like, more of meta teams. But, you know, he's holding up really nicely. He's a very, very good card. I think that his dribbling with the sniper chemistry style is very nice. I don't necessarily feel like I need the pace boost so far on the card as well. So, I'm enjoying it so far, man. I like his positioning there. He doesn't overcommit when he doesn't need to. He's kind of like, uh, he's like, when he was making the run forward, he wasn't really sure if he needed to make the run. He's kind of like, oh, do I make it here? I'm not really sure. First time volley. Nice. Good goal. I'm really liking Cunha's card, guys. His dribbling with the sniper chemistry style is actually very responsive, man. He moves very quick on the ball. Off the ball movement is fantastic with those medium, medium workouts because you guys know I got a soft spot for that. Um, yeah, man, I got no complaints with the card so far. I think everything that he offers in game is definitely being super noticeable. See? Really responsive, man. And the thing about this card, too, is that you can tell that he has really good physical presence, too. His physical stat, uh, his uh, body type in game is really big. Uh, and it makes such a huge difference to have that type of body type. Because that with good dribbling is super beneficial to have. Thanks, Derek. I'm just hoping we get a nice, quick tempo from the start of this game. Both teams do like to get forward. Both oh, my God. His dribbling is so fast, dude. Great little shot right there, too. Go, Mateos. Nice, Mateos. Oh my God! Why? Why? Good hold-up play again with Cunha. Great first touch as well, man. Nice. Get that finesse shot off. Oh my God! Yay! Let me score the finesse. Let me score the finesse. Yay! Power strikes are the only ones that are like really like consistent in this game, right? So that's why you go for them mostly, but oh my god, they really should. With 99 finishing there, decent composure. Like I wonder if it's composure that threw him off a little bit, but ah I got it. At least we got the rebound, got that power strike across goal. Guys, I'm telling you, this card's actually really sick with the sniper chemistry style, man. What can he do from here? Oh, if he didn't block my run, I still could get this. Oh my god, I don't even know why I made that pass there. It, it shouldn't have it shouldn't have impeded my, with my run right there though. I should have been able to get through there. Mateos, Cunha. Mateos again. Beautiful. Alright guys, so final verdict on the card. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a really, really good card. I actually really enjoyed the way that he was moving around the pitch. I thought he was absolutely brilliant. It's actually one of those cards, right? Because he has 90 finishing and 92 shot power, it's it, this is a card you should really experiment with the different chemistry styles in regards to footman they decide to give him a hunter an engine a hawk uh there's a lot of different chemistry styles you can give him his dribbling is actually so responsive with the sniper chemistry style right that it was really really fun to use them but from time to time sometimes sometimes i wanted the pace right so what i'm thinking with this card in particular is that maybe if you give him what do they what do they offer him in this? An a hunter, I can't use a hunter. An engine, an engine is the other chemistry style that I was mentioning to you guys. I'm telling you guys this right now, if you guys give him an engine chemistry style, even with the 81 composure, I think that this card 
with the engine or the sniper is going to be brilliant for you. I think you should experiment with both to see um, what you prefer the most. If the 90 finishing and 92 shot power bothers you, and the 81 composure bothers you, you know, try to switch some things around to see if it works out. But I'm telling you guys, his dribbling was so good with the sniper chemistry saw. I think that if you increase the balance and agility, as well as the pace with the card, as well as passing, because the passing boost they give him with the engine is quite nice. He could even be used as a cam if you really want to. I think, I, honestly, as a cam, this card would be brilliant. As a cam or as a striker. I'm excited because he was actually really good in game, guys. I think this card is absolutely brilliant. Um, with the sniper chemistry saw, that's the one I was using. I really, really liked it. But maybe with the engine, guys, the engine might be the go-to to use in the card. Because, guys, really, really good, man. Really, really good card. And for how much? He's like 262 he was 262k before I saw him, but now he's 302k. So maybe someone did a review on him recently and, and told and told people that he was sick. But yeah, guys, Brazilian links, Bundesliga links, like there's so much you can do with those links, right? I think the card is definitely worth it, even if it's 302k. He's very, very good in game, guys. So uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I will catch you guys for the next one. Peace out, dudes. Love you guys.